Good morning, Saturday morning here in Cypress, Texas. I'm getting ready to go to the um, Northwest Houston office for their Saturday presentation and then training after that with um, the, the John Woo team. And actually, all of WSB and then John Woo's team. And uh, last night I was at the office till late with one of my new um, associates, new campaigners, and got her completed her fast start, got her signed up for the training. I can't figure out how to do the get them signed up for their test um, other than the uh, NIPR um, link through my WFG. I just send it to them and get them to um, schedule their their test. But um, afterwards, there was a RWB stands for Red, White, and Blue. It's a bunch of veterans that uh, run rigged road races and stuff like that. 5Ks, 10Ks, half marathons, marathons. And um, it's in, a, in an attempt to reduce the um, veteran suicide rate. 22 veterans a day on average kill themselves. Crazy. And, um, <clears throat> well, for some it was supposed to be burger night, and for some reason the commander decided not to have it. But I met a couple guys and got them. You know, as, soon as, they, as soon as they saw the uh, campaign flyer, like, oh, I need to talk to you. I'm like, all right, man. What are you doing tomorrow morning? They were busy, so I'll have to get with them later. But um, they getting out into the community, getting um, connections other than the church. The church people are all coming from California, Canada, and Australia, <laughs> and um, they stay within the in, in their community. They're they're you know so I'm trying to work with them and reaching out, teaching them form to connect with people to promote the church. But, um, <clears throat> but, um, I'm doing what I can getting in my, you know, my niche, the veterans, you got a couple of niches, right? Um, boxing gyms, veterans, um, mortgage real estate professionals, that kind of thing. And, uh, getting out to the community and, uh, w you know, what, what it is, is you're going to connect with somebody, a center of influence. And when they, when they see what we're doing and they believe in what we're doing, it's real easy for them to refer or talk to people about what we're doing. And that's the trick. And uh, again, there's so much that people don't understand and you can open their eyes to that. <clears throat> and um, they're like, oh, wow, you know. And it, it's just amazing to me how few people um, understand this stuff. And there's a lot of reasons. Um, I talk to people about, you know, what was their earliest money memory? And they'll tell you, you know, and um, they'll, and then it, that's how that affects how they handle money the rest of their life. Okay. And uh, they had a bad experience. They don't like money. They, they steer away from it. Right. All right. Um, hope this benefits somebody. If it does, go ahead and share it. But, um, have a great Saturday.